Okay, here's what it was looking like Friday the 5th. Friday the high was 23, low was 2. I like showing you each day like this just so you can see the changes in the front yard and the snow depths and stuff. And then we have Saturday the 6th. And on Saturday the high was 17, low was 3. And as you can see we had a dusting of snow overnight and snow first thing in the, in the morning. Report from the town, good conditions up to a 9 inch base. And then we got some time lapses up at Stillwater Information Center in Macaulay. Show you guys what went on today. And you can see there's a dusting of snow on the edge of the railing. And as the sun slowly peeked its eye in and out, it melted it off. Long range forecast. You know, I wouldn't give up the towel yet. Looks good till Wednesday. Wednesday's definitely going to be a questionable day. But by Saturday next weekend, we're going to be back to winter temperatures with some snow in the air. So as long as we don't see too much liquid, we're going to survive this. And there's, there'll still be some riding left this year. Will be springtime conditions, but we got two more weeks that we could have potentially good riding. And then the next, Mr. J took the camera out for me. I had to watch it for a second and figure out what trail he was on. He was up on trail one. And as you can see, there's good snow coverage. See the snow dust coming off the back of the sled. Don't look too bad for Saturday morning. Amazing once we get a little moisture in the snow, how much better it holds and freezes down so much better. And then we're up at Stillwater. Mr. Cole there. He was taking a break. You having fun? Wave to the camera, say bye. All right, good job, kid. And then they shot over to Beaver River. So, hope everybody had a great weekend. Got some riding in. As I said, I wouldn't throw the towel in yet because it's not over till the gates swing shut. Hope you're having a good one. And remember,